Hello Aquarius, welcome back to my place. I say shall speak some messages. Gypsy Vishtaro, sending you love all the way from India. Bharat Namaste. Let's start with the reading. I am on Instagram, S-A-S-H-E-L-L-S-S-A Shals Running. I'm also on Patreon. Once you join, you get the access over there, okay? Now, there's a very sweet message that I'm hearing. This may not resonate with all of you at the same time, okay? Because some are single, some are involved, some are just, you know, figuring out about each other and all that stuff. So let's start. So I always say it's about twin flame soulmates and connections, okay? This may give you the vibe of like new connections as well. So um, your message is, oh, they love you, okay? Whether you are aware or not, some of you know with your intuition, oh yes, this person loves me, okay? So if you're not sure about something and you are literally trying to figure out or uh, know someone or talking to someone, even if there is little talk and all that stuff, or maybe it is a reconnection in some way, however this fits you, there is this, oh, they love you. This card was trying to come out, okay? No matter how hard they try to stay away from you or goes vice versa for Aquarius, okay? So I kind of get this energy while I'm doing this. is like July. 2023 okay but I also sense like as per your timelines apply it but I sense like it's it's a in-depth feeling I don't know how but it's something because of course July is coming but of course it is also centered for some of you around in a particular time frame but the message is oh they love you so are we supposed to be taking this card yes we're supposed to be taking this card this is ace of cups energy in your life I'm seeing this with you this is two of cups energy and you have high energy or level of reunion of some sort someone will end up confessing their love to you someone will be more expressive here and I feel like they're asking me to take this particular card as well like one from bottom one from top okay let's see so their sincerity their feelings uh, they never changed it never changed kind of we can put that okay it was it's still there but whatever the situation is, maybe they're holding on to certain responsibility. Maybe they're trying to pull away. Maybe they stay away, but you are their wish. If you can put that. Oh, they love you. Okay. So, if you want to take it as July, somewhat energy is very interesting here. You have love coming in your life. You have this uh, very... A beautiful connection coming in your life with this you're going to reunite with certain someone possible from past okay now it depends whether you allow what wherever you are what is happening in your life okay and what you have decided to do that's a different thing be responsible for your karma but what I see very clear is that there is love that's going to blossom okay there is love definitely I don't want to take any kind of other word like but this person misses you they are going to share certain memories with you moments with you and goes same for you there is this love coming okay and it's going to be um, exciting but it's going to be someone who can't resist um, not to talk to you and also this is now this may be someone new in the picture because there is ace of cups and they're going to ask you out on a date or something they want to know about more about you if there's exchange of number it's going to happen but for many of you possible the percentage may be 50 50 or 80 20 that um, some of you are going to reunite with certain someone from your past and there's going to be pace up energy this person is impatient or they are going to be because they can't resist not to talk to you okay this may be an Aries Leo Sagittarius okay they are fixed on you sort of like and they find solace and you know stability when they talk to you four of wands energy someone over here wants to get engaged to you some may want to you know engage and then get married to you let's see in the future what is coming because 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 there is a lot of uh, there's a lot of reasons to to this connection I don't know whether I'm being able to express this exactly or not but it's like it's something that's of like infinity like 
it's souls twin flames or however the connection is it's, it's intertwined okay and i did one of the readings of intertwining i suppose virgo okay and the virgo reading was oh that was my gloss <laughs> And the Virgo reading uh, was uh, for June, okay? Now, maybe you're listening this in June. Maybe you're going to listen this in July or ahead. That's why I said that the calling is about the timeless, but there's also something connected with <clears throat> July kind of vibe. Even if you listen in August, and it doesn't matter, okay? It doesn't matter, at least from my side. Sometimes readings will be in that time zone it's going to happen exactly sometimes it is like a week ahead week before it depends so oh they love you and that's really been indicated here okay let's see in the future there is there's chit chat happening you know how do you want to take chit chat as there's a lot of emotional conversation that is going to be happening to and fro. There is someone who does want to reach out to you and there is someone who may ask you. Now, one thing, there, there, there is something that they are caught up in, but they're also uh, sort of like when I said stuck on you, not in a negative way, but more of like positive. And this energy is trying to say, are you single Aquariuses? Like it's in this picture, in your reading, you are being here. You're not settling uh, relationship-wise. Someone is going to ask you, and then that depends on you what you're going to do, but you're free. You're free to choose because you're single. Okay, um, let's see peekaboo in the future. But there is someone who is coming from far. Now, in a way, contacting you in a way talking to you, in a way arrival, and you have this interesting. Someone who is coming from far in a way of like a uh, wire to wire conversation, in a way of like, physically moving towards you. You also have this. The chariot could be Aquarius. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe you're dealing with another Aquarius. Okay, don't mind. Uh, the chariot is Cancerian. I know, okay? I know that. There may be Piscean. Uh, but what I mean to say here is that someone is looking forward to meet you in the coming time, meet you in these moments. Maybe someone is going to reach to you in coming, like, to your place if there's physical distance, geographical, in around nine months or more. It's also the energy of, like, connection of, did I say nine years? Maybe after nine years, they're contacting you. Sorry. Okay, I was about to say nine months. And if I said that, no offense. Okay, just correct it because there are two messages. Nine years and nine months. So nine months is about contacting you or more than that. And nine years is about nine or ten. is about the connection of whole, like, you know, after ten years or nine years, they're contacting you. You're contacting this person. But it's a while. It's, it's a long time. Not even... In, if you want to put that exact, maybe for some of you, it's going to resonate, okay? But what is the matter is that, oh, they love you. Knight of Cups energy. Someone is apologizing for their, something that they did. Now, what they did, there is something that is connected with miscommunication or something that they wanted always to tell you, but they never did. Um, Knight of Cups energy is definitely a rival and offer someone who's who'll say that oh I love you there is offer there's love there is offer that's the bottom energy but we're still going to shuffle of course this is gentleman ace of hearts this person was in love is in love they're going to be in love with you. And same goes for you. Whether you're masculine, whether you're feminine listening. They want to express something very deep. They want to possibly get engaged to you. Uh, you people are also somehow karmically connected. Now karma doesn't mean negative always. This may feel positive, but never happened properly. There's ring. Magically, this person will propose you or... They're going to express something 
out of the blues that they love you because they love you or they love you I want to say here that maybe you are dealing with someone or you're going to deal uh, this person if you are free like free in a way like if you're single not dating anyone not involved with anyone I feel like this person who is coming all the way we are wire talk or literally someone who is coming all the way in your life uh, reuniting with you they might be in connection already they might have the nest somewhere maybe they're married or involved uh, but there is always purpose to some things so you're going to figure out soon ship someone is stressed they're far geographically okay even if emotionally connected with you they are working somewhere they might be like overseas wherever the country or miles or kilometers in your life ten of swords here is something that this journey is on and on and on but I feel like the news is that they love you this person is looking forward to connect with you but they are in the middle of something right now they may have some things attached with them as I said so maybe they are having already their nest uh, they may have husband wife uh, you know they may be married that's what is uh, they may be living somewhere they have a target to full fulfill okay um, they may have water in their chart cancer Scorpio Pisces they may have and you also have the card but they're also giving me the wife they also have the wand energy fire so maybe they are an Aries Leo or Sagittarius though whoever and whichever sign it is messages of importance if it pertains to you some type of they may be in the area of like where there is something connected with the dragon okay some things like in tradition culture they might be living there or they might belong to that place so you may exactly give countries even If I take this as your thing, you being here, then you have something going in your mind. You might be thinking about why something possible ended. You don't want to, you don't wish to ruin something in your life right now, which is very important to you. There is this masculine energy. Take a closer look here. Okay, this masculine wants to give you or they sorry they want to give you good news but something may be stressful like journey figuring out but they love you and this is the person gentleman this person loves you things are going to be like some things need to be put an end to there is a stuck energy. You have anchor and nine of spades energy. So this might be the challenge that someone is stuck somewhere while working. And I want to say that this is going to be different habitats. Maybe different countries, cultures, so different habitats, lifestyle and all that stuff. Or maybe this is right now different countries and not different culture means maybe they are from the uh, same place for example Australia or for example India or for example Dubai or, or, or US okay but same but staying somewhere else so distance geographical distance now it can be in any ways but the main thing here is that two energies from different habitats they are going to enter you may play the role of making their ship move this can happen very strong you may be the mermaid just exam just imagine you are the mermaid and you're going to be helping this person's ship 
to to take further like you're going to play play the role of the wind in someone's life the stress gonna decrease basically it's going to descend like this shouldn't ascend okay stress should should not ascend so it's basically descending the stress and anxiety more comfortable zone between you both one step less anxiety okay or however you want to put that like there is some sort of stress between you both between you both in a way of like how to come back to one another so someone is stuck somewhere their ship is already in the ocean and you know it okay so it's about you may play the role of treasure in their life okay they're looking forward for direction and you may be the direction for them it's very interesting you may be their direction as if like you know they are here you know it and you know they love you and they are looking for new direction from here what i can do to be with you or what we can do to connect more on a beautiful level what is that they want let's see these two cards are so interesting ship and anchor like it's connected you have anchor on the ship you put that anchor someone gonna stop in your life stop in your life and you come up uh people been looking for each other for a very long time especially connections of soulmates okay which you can put that in twin or something as in journey but you both been looking for each other quite a long time and now you people are here they don't want to pull the anchor they don't want to and when they're going to drop the anchor you know that they are here so when you know you're going to look up and you're going to like a mermaid you're going to up see hey and he's looking for you this is masculine coming your way for some of you yes exactly please give me the signs what is in love and what is about this person okay i know you they know you you know them i know you what happened okay i heard it's true it's true that they love you that's what the first message was like maybe it's true they're here like you wanted to hear that are they here and yes it's true they're here it's about the news that's going to spread i don't know what sort of news someone is going to get uh what's that someone is going to get the confirmation of someone's return uh, let's say that let's say that you have seven of swords energy it's freaky i don't know how but it's freaky uh this is a uh, unsettling this is something that this cannot be lied can't be lied anymore this is expression there are messages i see but there is also truth that is required because there are things those are hidden and if you are going to start something on a base of like lie or hidden things it is going to show you the black clouds basically it's not clear so you people need clear sky to have something even to start this i mean to say this oh they love you okay fine but you are stuck in the ocean this is about someone who's collecting the information someone who stole someone's heart but this is also we can start something on the base of lie okay we can't hide it oh you look for me oh the anchor is here but there's a lot of but in your reading why there is seven of swords okay they are lying if they're not telling you that they love you someone is having deep thoughts of like what to do now wanting new beginning with you you want a new beginning with the person challenging though with seven of swords 
we need to be not to be secretive. We can't keep secrets to continue doing something. We need to have faith, but there's also dare. Let's begin, because there is something that's going to be approaching, I'm telling you that. There's the indication of uh, someone who is, they want to love you with no complications. So it's also about free will. Someone who is coming towards you, you going towards them, because you both expect this. And look, Zero the Fool is major card. Because it's major, it's it's trying to give you the energy of like with the free and no complications going ahead with something. Uh, someone need to be free from the lies and they need to claim it and they need not to keep secret about you and this person, them basically. Um, okay, let me take one more card. Okay, fine. I knew it. Something was never claimed back then in the past, but this is also the energy of Six of Cups resurgence. Definitely, you also have Two of Cups energy. With this, someone is having memory flashback and all that stuff. Six of Cups is someone from your past is coming. And this is about, I feel like with the double indication, this is about it's been long that you've been away emotionally and physically. But now you know your past is touching your finger. Like, is it possible? Is it possible? Yes, it is. Oh, they love you. But this is also someone you connected way back. I'm telling you years, and now again, this is also someone from like lifetime, lifetime kind of energy. Like after life, after life. Like people asked for each other in this life, and we want to be together, kind of energy. Um, there's a lot of forgiving and learning in this process. Okay. Attraction is here. It's a long time attraction, not just one day or two day attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Yes, it's a long time attraction. It's coming after separation as well. Mm. They look at you like a rose or you look at them like a rose. Rose can be male, rose can be female, doesn't matter. Forgiving and learning definitely in this time frame. Maybe you're forgiving yourself and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. You people are going to, I feel like for some, uh, letting go of control issues. You're going to let go, like however this unfolds in my life. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. like something is happening or is going to happen which is going to be just it's like in the moment there's no word for this but it's something that people would love to figure out there is something happening it's like like in the Egypt in the desert area you never were aware about that something I am digging or something that that was not in in, in front of you uh, but you were not aware that it is in front of you okay to explain you precisely it is something that this is the spot something is not here but it is here because it is underneath and then in the season or in the time frame and the the, the, the watch is saying 12 and then it's going to be coming out and you're going to see a miracle in your life. Something is going to be in front of you, I mean to say. Like you're, you're wandering, like you're roaming, you're figuring out where, but it's not according to the plan, but the, but, but the map, okay, but the map says it is here. That, that is the spot. I know it. And then suddenly you're just returning and something is going to be popping out of that. And it's like as if like the seed is there and it's going to grow and the tree is here. So basically it's something that is there since ages and now you're going to figure that out. Oh yes, it is here. Oh yes, it is here. You people are going to give chances to each other. <sighs> give your relationship a chance. 
Work on your partnership. So some of you are going to do it. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. I said so someone going to make the romantic gesture. Oh, I love you. Strong chemistry as well. Take care and see you soon. Bye-bye.